You want to do another stop? It's just a minute away. To stop then, yeah? Yeah, man, two. Are you okay? If she feels sick, I'm gonna charge you the vomiting fee. I'm fine, driver. Nice to meet you, fine. I'm driver. <laughs> Plans for tomorrow night? Plans for tomorrow night. Netflix and spaghetti. I'm... I'm doing a gig tomorrow at the Bill Murray. If you're free, maybe you could... Yeah! Uh, um, sorry. I'm so drunk. I'd, I'd like to. Okay. Cool. Ahem. <clears throat> Postcode, please. A cat fight. <laughs> Mia, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. I should respect your privacy. But I do deserve a bro face. Did you? Bro face, come on. Naughty. Got the meat wallet going? <laughs> You're such a stupid bitch. <laughs> she is. His name is Luca, but for some reason they call him Panino. Panino? Is that a role? He's a stand up comedian. He's invited me to his gig tomorrow night. You're coming, right? If only I didn't have this super secret thing to do. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> Bo, are you coming? I... I'm not sure. I don't want to be around Julia. Seriously? Life is not a box of chocolates. Are you really misquoting Forrest Gump right now? Last night, we were waiting for you for an hour. Fifteen people waited on Mademoiselle Julia, who didn't even bother to call. I am sure that you were one of those spoiled little girls that were never told no. And you must have a sad story about your childhood, your village being ravaged by the West. My dad is a clockmaker. You heard. I'm a dick. Yeah, you are. But it looked more personal. It was very personal. Is it the Colombian guy again? Is that why you're acting so weird? What? No! Are you in any danger? No, I'm not! Did you tell him where we live? No, Mia! I respected your rules. Just let me help. I just need time to... Now come to my own reconstruction of the night of the murder. Mind that, my dear. What? The swing? It was a farewell gift. An old prop. It was given to me when I got married. A farewell to what? My career. St. Martin's Theatre, back in the 60s. Why did you give it up? It was a given. But it's fine. I'm going to get everything back. I always get everything back. I'd love to see if the present I bought for you suits you. Do you mind? Gma? Julia, what the hell is that? I bought it for her at the charity shop. You bought a furry fucking PJ? 
Did you hear it was someone at the door earlier? Yes, dear. Why didn't you open it? Because I wasn't expecting any deliveries. Yes, but I was. Don't oh. talk to me like that. Sorry, G-Mob. You have to pick up from some shit old depot now. Well, I'm very sorry. I'll buy you another one at the charity shop. It says here you can pick it up from tomorrow. No big deal. Shut it, all right? Cephas, don't be so rude. Julia's part of the family. Thanks, Timon. Why'd you call me here? Cephas, I'm trying to watch this film. Patience, dear. Family meeting. Oh, don't leave that lying around, darling. Our friend Marcus has told me that a young man is dealing at the North College. Our North College? No fucking way. Every time Marcus approaches him, the guy disappears. He may know us. No fucking way. This is his bag. I'm gonna fucking kill this guy. Well, we could do the usual. Oh. No need for that. Marcus has told me exactly where he'll be tonight. Where? The college is throwing a zoo-themed ball. And, and we could use some kind of bait. That's a fantastic idea. It's a great idea, Cephas. Oh, really? Yeah, sure. Very mature plan. So I guess you won't have a problem being the bait, then? Come again? You look like an average college girl. This guy would trust you. You could wear a new pyjamas. You'd fit right in at the party. You've been with us long enough. Indeed. She's perfect. Oh, Julia. I'm so glad you're part of the family now. Baby. It's a good plan. But I wouldn't know how you to... You don't have to talk much. Just say as little as possible, and then it's our gig. Here. Just show him these. It's a big party, so he'll probably have some on him. And make sure you move him away from the crowd. Can you do that, darling? But you won't hurt him, will you? We're just going to have a little chat with him. Are you sure? Because I don't want to get involved in... You him. have my word. Okay. I guess I could. You'll be fine. We can trust you. Can't we? This is the Bill Murray, tomorrow at 10. If you're a true friend, don't wear heels. Hey, Juan. We need to meet. Tomorrow night, the Bill Murray.
incredible people. 